now I will talk about how you how you uh, export HMI libraries and first it's necessary that you import the desired yeah, HMI symbols you can either add HMI images or HMI symbols um, for now I prepared an HMI image that I want to import now it's a it's the logo of Phoenix contact and now we have the logo in in the local images um, folder of the HMI section and we could now use it in our HMI application and yeah now we want to um, export it as an HMI library so we go into file export and export as release HMI library we will first have to save it it's basically the same as um, yeah, exporting a device library. So we first have to add our folder path, add the yeah, de desired name that we want to use for the library. I will use HMI test here now. And just like in the settings of the device library, it will add the file type uh, PCWLX at the end. Uh, here we can add, uh, if desired, a version and a uh, further description um, of the library. Next, we can set the redistribution type. And it basically determines if the user is able to release his or her project as a library. If your library or this library we are, we are um, generating right now is included into the project. So you can set it either to unlimited or to one level only. And um, yeah, next there's create new library ID. It's here in gray. And um, it basically says if your project has been released um, as, a, as a library before, this um, you would see uh, this, this setting is what would be active, create a new library ID. And uh, if it's checked, you can see it here it would create a new library ID for yeah, your library. Um, next, in this field, you can see all the yeah, HMI symbols and the images that are included into your new library. And um, yeah, next, you can either save and close it um, in order to yeah, save all the settings we just set here and um, yeah, do the export later. Uh, so we can do save and close. And you could open export export as HMI library. You first have to save it again. And now you can see we have all the settings that we just set earlier. And yeah, by pressing release, we can release um, and generate our HMI library.